Hello guys, welcome to Safe Trader. This is Arvind. So, what a beautiful rally that we had today in Nifty and Bank Nifty on both index. And if you actually remember, early morning I shared a video on how we would need to follow levels on Nifty and Bank Nifty today, right? So, I clearly updated you that do not take any entries here around this zone which is trading around 16,096 but I told you that in case if it breaks on the downside here 16,020 16,020 I asked you to go with a target of 15,911 that's the target that I was talking about so look at the beautiful fall and we have taken an entry here and booked profits here and it was a rally of somewhere around 100 points on the downside so we were able to book profits here right and after that and again it was taking a reversal we have not taken an entry because we wanted to wait for this level again so once this level is broken 16,020 and we have taken an entry again and we went up to first target 16,096 and second target 16,172 such a beautiful rally from the bottom so we were able to book on the put side on the call side two times here so you know this is what i have shared in the morning itself do not buy anywhere you know in between when there is no proper level and there is no proper level we shouldn't buy at all because i gave you a level where you need to buy and sell so this is very much clear that you should buy around this zone okay and sell it here and if there is another price action you can buy around this zone at the retest and go with a target and this was the final target for today that was 16,265 however since there was a beautiful bully rally and we were able to close around 16,170 above okay so we were able to book profits on both sides and nifty and bank nifty so um, let's go ahead and check bank nifty as well what we have done and how levels were playing around okay so if you actually look at even in bank nifty i shared the same levels in bank nifty as well and i said you know in the morning go with the target of this go with the target of 34036 in the morning itself and if it breaks only then we can go for 34195 since it has not broken look at that you know particular level that i said it exactly from that level it has taken a rejection exactly from that level right so it has not broken here and so we have not taken an entry now since it has taken a reversal and i asked um, you know whoever is a risky trader can take an entry here or safe trader can take an entry here where 34723 for risky traders okay and 17 uh, sorry uh, 34,824 is going to be for safe traders so whoever has taken an entry here they are able to book you know uh, for the target of 35,131 so that's a beautiful target for the risky traders so how many points of rally we had from here we had a rally of somewhere uh, close to 400 points so if it were to be one lot you would have been getting at least 10,000 with this rally or if you are a safe trader you should have been taking an entry somewhere here and then that was a rally of 300 points which is closer closing to 7,500 with one lot of bank nifty option right so basically you know at every level we were able to trade here so this was a risky uh, level which I shared I clearly said go back to uh, the video that I said you know i clearly said risky can take around this level and go with a target of 35131 and safe traders can take an entry around 34824 and go with a target of 35131 so basically what is happening around this zone here is that you now if you actually look at on a higher time frame let me clear the screen okay if you actually look at on a higher time frame here look at this it has completely broken uh, the three week gap look at this this was the gap right 
So, this was the gap that was created on 5th May. Okay, look at this. 5th May, there was a gap that was created. And after that, for about 2 to 3 weeks, that gap was never filled. Now, today, after the beautiful rally, the gap was also filled. And also, I would like to share with you that, you know, the beautiful rally that we had today is mostly backed by HDFC Bank or HDFC and also ICICI Bank and not Kotak Bank. Kotak Bank was bullish for past uh, two to three days, but today it is completely under pressure. It was not performing good. So, hopefully tomorrow, if you see Kotak Bank performing good, we might see some more bullish run on the upside. Right. So, what are we going to look at for the next target? So, next target is going to be somewhere here, 35,406 on the upside. So, let's go ahead and check what are the levels that we will be looking at Nifty and Bank Nifty for tomorrow. Okay. So, Nifty, for example, let's see. Now, currently, Nifty has closed around 16,170 if you carefully look at 16,000. 170 right so in case if it opens a gap up we will not take an entry until 16,220 is broken so it has to break and then we will go with the target of 16,306 that's going to be target one for us and target two is going to be 16,000 okay 16,420 is going to be our target two in nifty but this is going to be a huge or major resistance for us so don't expect 420 immediately okay so let's look for target one initially which is 16300 only above 16220 please only above 16220 so if it is opening a gap down so it is like 16160 16160 below we will go with the target of 16,100. Only 60 points of target, but that's fine. Okay. We shall look for some uh, deep in the money options and take a put option, book it. And in case if 16,100 is broken, our target is going to be 16,025 on the downside. This is going to be target one and this is going to be target two for us. Okay. So remember, this is going to be huge resistance, huge major resistance. So do not take any immediate uh, call options when it is around this zone. So, I would say we will only trade for this target one tomorrow first and then we will approximately go about to 16,400 maximum and after that we will close our positions and we don't trade until this 16,420 level or major resistance level is broken completely. Once this is broken, we will go for the gap filling trade okay basically we'll go for the range of i mean look at this okay we'll look for the range of 16600 on the upper side okay so this is going to be our long term support which is like probably end of july or something like that based on how nifty is playing around okay so please make a list of uh, or note down these levels for us tomorrow and then we will trade accordingly in nifty and let's check in bank nifty as well as I said, you know, Bank Nifty has been actually rejecting from this zone for past two to three weeks in Bank Nifty. And today, after a beautiful rally, it has broken this major resistance zone and has already filled the gap. Has already filled the gap. As I said, you know, we were playing with the levels. Now, we have taken an entry here and we were able to book profits around 35,200. And 35,131 was our target today and we have already hit the target target was done and it went up to 35200 now tomorrow what are we going to do or what is our expectation for tomorrow okay so tomorrow in case if it opens a gap up okay if it opens a gap up and breaks or sustains above 35205 okay we are looking at the same level 35000 okay 205 if it breaks this and sustains above this Currently, it is trading around 35,094, right? So, if it breaks 205 on the upper side or if it opens a gap up, we will directly go for the target of 35,885 on the upper side. So, this is a big target. Remember this, guys. 
this is a very big target somewhere around 680 points of target on the upside okay and once this is broken completely we'll take um, a long position up to 36560 okay so this is going to be also huge but we shall not immediately trade 680 points but we will trade based on the price action how that is going to give us an opportunity we'll wait for a price action like a retest okay then take an entry and go with the target of 35885 and on the downside on the downside we shall wait for this particular resistance zone to be broken okay we will wait for this resistance zone to be broken somewhere around 34800 once that is broken on the downside we will go with the target of 34300 on the downside as the target one this is going to be target one and if this breaks we'll go with the target of 33000 on the downside with a major support of 34000 okay this is going to be major support and then once this is broken 33000 is going to be our final target on the downside but i don't expect 34000 to be reached anytime sooner but we shall keep our levels ready in case if it breaks 34367 our next target which is target 2 is going to be 34000 which is here okay 34000 is going to be next zone and after this 34000 we will look for 33500 okay let me clear the screen okay so once 34367 which is this which is broken we'll go with the target of 34000 and then if 34000 is broken 33500 is going to be the target and then 33000 finally but on the upside i am expecting a you know a gap up tomorrow if it opens a gap up we will directly go with the target of 35882 okay and then final target is going to be 36559 so now for long position holders or option sellers who wants to trade in futures i would certainly tell you if it hits 35882 please do not buy any positions for 36000 please short it go with the target of 35600 immediately okay and then if there is a price action we can go back to 36000 zone okay so until then we will not take any trades on the upside okay so hope you are able to follow these levels and uh, tomorrow we i will give you more crispy levels these are all very long levels i'm talking about see 36500 35800 which is a gap of somewhere around 800 points here and there is around 700 points of gap between here and um, there is around 1000 points or um, you know 900 points of gap here you know there is another 1300 points of gap here so these are on you know very long levels that i am talking about but tomorrow i will share uh, the levels for the intraday correctly and where point by point where we would need to trade and how we can earn profits by tomorrow morning so if you have um, not joined our telegram channel the link will be in the description please do join the telegram channel and you will get timely updates there okay thank you so much and if you like this video content please do like share and subscribe to our channel thank you so much you have a great day ahead